The first step to any transfer is ensuring that you have the correct sling. So be sure to check out our detailed sling selection guide before diving into these how-to videos. Today, we're going to demonstrate how to safely transfer a patient from their wheelchair to a toilet using a toileting sling. Start by locking the wheels of the patient's wheelchair. Ask the patient to lean forward and tuck the sling in behind them. Next, pull the leg straps along the outside of the patient's legs, making sure that the straps don't catch on any part of the wheelchair. Connect the support belt and safety buckle, making sure that it is snug but not too tight. Position yourself in front of the patient and gently raise each of the patient's legs to pull the straps underneath and over the patient's legs. You want the straps to be mid-thigh on the patient for the most comfortable transfer. Finally, cross the leg straps, pulling one strap through the other and you're ready to bring in your lift. With the patient's wheelchair locked, but not the lift, approach the patient with the lift, connect your sling loops to the lift bar, keeping in mind that the shorter loops will result in a more reclined position. Before lifting, make sure that the patient is fully inside the sling and that the straps and loops are not caught on the wheelchair. With one hand on the patient and one hand on the lift controls, slowly begin lifting the patient. As the patient's wheelchair is locked in place while the lift is not, the lift will move toward the patient rather than jerking them out of the chair. With the patient lifted, you can now move them easily towards the toilet. Once you have positioned the patient over the toilet, lock the lift in place. With the patient's permission, pull the patient's pants down to just above the leg straps. With one hand on the patient and one hand on the lift controls, slowly begin lowering the patient until they are fully seated on the toilet. Unhook the sling loops from the lift, unlock it, and move the lift out of the way. Some patients may want some additional freedom of movement, which you can provide by gently lifting each of the patient's legs to remove the leg straps. You can now assist the patient in pulling their pants all the way down to the ground before exiting the bathroom. When you return, help the patient pull their pants up and gently lift each of the patient's legs to pull the straps underneath and over the patient's legs. Cross the straps and remember that you want them positioned at mid-thigh for the most comfortable transfer. Bring the lift back in, but do not lock it in position and attach the sling loops to the lift bar. With one hand on the patient and one hand on the lift controls, slowly begin lifting the patient. With the patient raised, you can assist them with wiping or other hygiene before pulling the patient's pants back up. You can now return the patient to their chair. 